All right, so maybe particles are not as dangerous as I was making them out to be, um, but they do collide. And with that collision, a very important thing is happening. Sound is able to travel. Scientists are really awesome, and they create awesome things. I was pretty much created from a scientist, so eh, I believe scientists can create some pretty cool things. One thing that's in your science curriculum is a simulator, and I feel like the simulator is the best way for you to see how those particles are colliding and sound is transferring. So let's check out that simulation and see what is exactly happening when sound is traveling. All right, so now we are looking at your simulation Currently, I'm going to be playing the violin, and with that, you can see all these particles. Now, again, these particles, as they are spread out pretty far apart, represent air particles. Now, the cool thing about your simulation is it's actually going to let you click on one of these particles, and once you click on one of those particles, you can start to see it move. You can see it colliding with the other particles, and as it's colliding over and over again, it's able to move around. Now, we'll watch our little particle here as sound. Now again, you can see the waves as they go right through, but just like in other demonstrations that we've done, that particle is basically staying in that one location. However, it is colliding with the particles around them, and in that collision comes something very special, the transfer of that sound energy from the particle that we have clicked on to another particle that it collides to. So really cool stuff. Particle collisions. Now comes your discussion. What I'd like for you to discuss is how sound energy travels. To do this in your discussion slides, I'm looking for you to use four words in that discussion post. I want you to write scientifically with a scientific explanation, okay? So to do that, I want you to use the word source, collision, energy, particle. Right. Using those four words, write an explanation to answer this question and see if you can tell me, using those four words in one to two sentences, how do you think the sound energy travels? All right, and once you get done with that, come and watch for our third and final video.